All right, guys, it's something I want you to see. If you're new to the channel, man, check this out. We are about holding our usage until we get what we want. Okay, so keep watching if you're on that type of thing. It says, I will never stop holding until AMP makes me a million gazillionaire. Look, I'm feeling that, okay? And I'm gonna show you guys why. So by the end of this video, you might change your perspective if you were thinking of panic selling and jumping ship on AMP just because it's at dun, 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 four, okay? And we did a video a couple days ago talking about what would happen if it goes to four. And then we did a video yesterday talking about the cryptocurrencies that look similar to this at their beginning. And then I showed you a scripture where God said, better is the end of a thing than the beginning thereof. So you guys need to learn how to hold out and have faith on investments and things in life period that have promise to them but might not be jumping as fast as you want them to that doesn't mean that they won't jump so holding until amp makes me a millionaire that is the right the right mentality to have why because if you thought it was a good investment before it was some things that was logical to you for a reason then just because this doesn't move when you wanted to doesn't change the logic of those uh, things that made you base the decision to jump in. Now, if you were jumping in because you thought this was some type of hype coin or something, then you were wrong and go ahead and dip. But most of the people that I found have jumped in because they know that this is an awesome investment long term long term like a startup company three to five years after everything is implemented it could be before then because they're making super fast moves with the flex and network okay so keep watching i'm about to show you something okay so i want you to see look listen look look junk in the trunk i love you okay so look i typed in bitcoin flex at el salvador i did a video covering this a couple weeks ago right but what i want you to see is the timestamps on this bitcoin uh, thing happening over there in El Salvador. We know that Bitcoin is taking over as the currency of El Salvador, and that's awesome. But guess what? They're going to need faster transactions, and Flex is who they're choosing to go with. Guess what, baby? So that is a usage case study, and this is real world application, like I've always talked to you guys about. So, what I'm saying now is that you have to give these uh, uh, these roadmaps and these white papers time to implement. You can't expect, we all love to say Rome wasn't built in the night, but the internet takes things and puts them on hyperdrive to the point where most things are instantaneously. If you want porn, you can just go ahead and get it right now. If you want food, you can go on DoorDash and get that right now. If you want movies, you can go on Netflix and get that right now. You don't have to get in the car. Everything is so simplistic that we think everything is supposed to work like that, but business doesn't work like that. Not real business and infiltration of countries and corporations and all type of gigantic stuff that they're doing behind the scenes, which will eventually translate over here. So it's a couple of people that were smart and they were saying that they're gonna just buy in. They're gonna keep buying in. They're gonna keep buying in. Guess what? Look, listen, look, picked up another 10K this morning, 120K total. All right, AMP has always been a dip. Uh, he said, I've always been a dipper. All right, so the thing about it is, look, more than 15K in AMP. The thing about it is, look, this matters not to those who have diamond hands. This matters not right now because whether it changes or not, you're not going to jump out. Look, some people are breaking even. Some people might even be losing right now. But what do you think happened with Amazon for 15 to 20 freaking years with the investors? What would have happened if they dipped out? No, what they did was they made money with other things that they had going on in their life and they had diamond hands. And that's why they're all billionaires for not jumping ship on Jeff Bezos, right? We want to be billionaires and millionaires too as well, right? So AMP can make you a millionaire. It definitely has that potential. Uh, am I God? Do I know exactly? No, but if you're going to hold some crap like Shiba Inu that literally has nothing behind it, no real reason other than hype, and it's definitely no shot at becoming a real world currency. You're just trading it for you traders. Go ahead and do your thing, man. It might look good. It might look better over here on the daily chart if you're obsessed with that. But for those who are really looking for something that can change their life in a couple of years and you're going to be awesome and, and happy that you held, then AMP and ACH, those are two, and even Cody I was paying attention to, are some of those that have potential to become the new world order 
uh, leaders in crypto, okay? So I strongly suggest diamond hands, but if you are just a trader, then this might be one of your, you know, best opportunities to get ready and, and everything like that. But hey, I, I strongly suggest holding. That'll just be, you know, in third person, me giving advice to myself, not giving an investment advice to you, but check the links in the description if you want real investments, that's awesome. But anyway, like I said, it's only been a couple months since the, this last news right here, and they're still working on other gigantic things as well, pause, you know what I'm saying? So can't sit here and just say, oh, well, since it ain't moving when I wanted to move, oh, well, it went down a little bit. These people are not paying attention to this. The ones that run this are not paying attention to this. You are paying attention to this because this is your only form of currency. They aren't paying attention to this because they're running real actual businesses. And once the things behind the scenes are implemented, then that's when this will move and translate over here. Just like those cryptocurrencies I showed you from 2007, they began moving over here because of the things in the back. Not because of you sitting here staring at this and desperately trying to sound smart, okay? <laughs> There's no way to predict what's gonna happen with this, okay? If you look at this, it just looks like it's just continually going, don't, no duh. I don't have to watch a YouTube video to see the trend of it going down, going up and going down. Rocky Road without the ice cream, but guess what? If you hold, you got the diamond hands, you hold strong, just go make money at trading the crap coins because this is not one, okay? You hold this one, forget it's in your portfolio and then one day, pow! Come to thou is going to be the biggest one in your portfolio, but slow down like Bobby Valentino, man. Slow down, put the brakes on. And remember that a lot of these stuff, like we, we'll get some news about Flex and Amp and, and just like two days later, we'll give up on it just because it haven't moved yet. Like, look, just because you got the news doesn't mean that it has, it's going to play out right then and there or translate over here right then and there. I think you guys have got pacified and suckered from all those spikes when something is listed on Coinbase or Binance or something like that. Come on, man. We're all adults here. These are actual businesses trying to start up and do something, majority of them, okay? And they're trying to do something that hasn't been done before. Give them a little bit of leeway. Have you guys ever created a currency and took over the world? No, but they have a shot at it. So give them a chance and a little bit of damn support. Godly, man.